Hey everyone, welcome to Legends Podcasting. I'm Stu. I'm Ross. Yeah, I'm Rob. And we're here for a Blue Beetle trailer. This is the second trailer from this film that's coming out on the 18th of August, which is now officially the first, not the first movie, but the first character mm. from the DCU, mm. Jamie Gunn's DCU. Around, yeah. So he's going to be kept on for this new universe. So um, yeah, we, we did the previous trailer, it looked really cool. Mm-hmm. Um, the suit looks amazing. Yeah. Um, graphics are pretty cool. He's a really, I mean, he's a really cool character. We know him very well from Young Justice, obviously, where we got in season two, three, about him three in the four. Reach, yeah, yeah. Um, <clears throat> I've read, I think I've read like a couple of comics with him, but he's not, there's not loads about him. But I was, I was saying, I was always more familiar with the Ted Cord version. Ted yes, and then maybe a few bits of Dan Garrett. But it's nice to see their costumes are in the old trailer mm. in the, the Beetle Cave or yeah. whatever they're going to call it underneath Cord Industries. So yeah, nice. it's quite interesting that they actually they brought all that in because I, I did wonder when, when it was announced. I was like, are they actually going to do the Ted Cord bit? But they are, which is mm. awesome. So um, it's kind of weird. I, like, I like how they retconned in the comics. They had um, the scarab, the thing, the thing that turns highly mm-hmm. into this. Like originally was an ancient Egyptian artifact that Dan Garrett found, which gave him magical powers, but drove him insane. Mm-hmm. And then Ted Cord inherited it and went, "Well, I saw that happen to Dan. I'm not touching that shit." And then they retconned it into being an alien artifact that drove him insane because the Reach was trying to get through Dan's mind. Yeah. And then they got to Jaime. Yeah. They yeah. also don't kill Ted again because he's not been. <laughs> they keep mentioning unless, him. Unless but he's already put him in. Unless, he's, unless he's already dead. Yeah. We got his wife looks like she's like. Uh, after it because she's saying that yeah. it belongs or to sister me. oh whoever mm. some relative uh, it's her Susan Saran don't I know. don't know no idea is that who it is that's where it was um, yeah and then obviously they had that <laughs> the last trailer had that end line that made the internet go crazy when he was like yeah. bad birds are fascists and everyone was like oh fuck this yeah. trailer this movie there's like one line it's called comedy yeah it's, <laughs> it's also called <laughs> deliberately doing that annoying fans to, to don't do it yeah. Like the trailer was good enough up to that point that you didn't need to put that I in. I know, yeah, it just, it just made me laugh. It, like, that's what everyone <laughs> talked about. Concentrate on yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's just like, don't worry about the, the awesome film, just that one line. Anyway, mm-hmm. hopefully they won't put it in this trailer. Um, but yeah, so I guess we'll just jump into this trailer, find out what, if there's okay. any new footage. I'm to see if footage. the Reach are going to be the villains in this or not, but uh, we'll see. Yeah, that was, that's a big first movie. I mean, yeah. maybe that's the second movie, but <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. So, so yeah, it's going to be this trailer. And just before we jump into this trailer, I want to thank everyone who's been subscribed to the channel. But if you've just found us due to this trailer, or you've been with us for a while and you haven't subscribed, do it before the reach gear. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> do it before we're invaded by aliens. So please click on that subscribe button. We really appreciate every subscribe we get. I really do mean that. So please click on that subscribe button, support our channel. Um, and yeah, we also do a Patreon as well. So head over there. We've got full reactions of all the shows we do, which we'll be um, doing, like Soka's coming up. We're doing Secret Invasion at the moment. We're doing the new Superman show. So please go and check, check out them. And let's jump into this trailer. Is he going to practice? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Straight off the side. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> go, Whip, go! You gotta force him to come out. What are you. What? Push him. Yeah. Genius. Well, I know. <laughs> I know. Nice. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. He's actually burned all his clothes on the thing as well. I think like so. Lex Court, what the hell was all that? It's called the Scarab. I had no idea it would activate. It has to choose you. So how do we get it to unchoose me? Oh, you don't. Yep. No, that's, that's, not, that's not an option. Hopes acquired. Who said that? Systems chapter 3. Okay. <laughs> okay. That could be quite a funny film, I think. Yeah. I hope it's got a bit of humour in it. Bus, yeah. He thinks it doesn't always obey you, so it's protecting him. But yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's just like the way Justice is like, let's go to just kill them, yeah. kill the impulse. Ooh. Go back of his head. Yeah, the other guy from the first trip. He's in surround, right? It's got to be the reach. Uh-huh. Maybe. Uh, I have no idea. What? He's like a robot. Cyborg. Oh, he's pissed. The hell? Uh, isn't that, that looks like, um, a t- titanium man? That mask. Could be with a T, right? Yeah. I bet it's an uh, artificially derived scarab. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's more like it. Oh, that's all. I love you for your family. Makes you elite. You're all my family. That's what makes me strong. Oh 
Oh, she's down his spine. Oh, I forgot how bad it was. <laughs> 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 it's a titanium eye, man. I'm going to wrong Sorry, I'm Shit. So good. You're the blue beetle. Hey, could you use that arsenal right about now? Oh, you never ask. talking to somebody, a friend of mine who's quite likes Blue Beetle, saying that they changed the comic, the tone of it, for New 52. Yeah. So prior to New 52, it's quite like heart and comedic. In New 52, it became really dour and serious. Okay. So that? Build... Oh, look at all these... Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah. buildings. Let's... Ace Chemicals. <laughs> Ace... What? Oh. <laughs> you can't have Ace Chemicals in the same block as Cord Industries. There's a baby one. That's really weird. It's well, like a sumo thing, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. A bit. What? Where's this supposed to be set? This is New Mexico. Um, <clears throat> it said it in the first room. Yeah, it did. Yeah. didn't they? This looks really futuristic compared to... Yeah. Well, maybe it's Metropolis, but... It could be Metropolis, right? They're flying there, yeah. Let's see a dead planet, though. See how they... Might be on a massive building. <laughs> plaza, right? Yeah. This look, it looks rather... Just the, I mean, just the graphics of that suit look great, man. It's Especially just, when he jumped off the thing and it's... Yeah, yeah. Of, yeah they like really spent some time clothing. doing the graphics well. It looks like he's got some sort of black mesh thing underneath, which would be great for like compensating for all of the bumps and stuff that he gets hit because mm. it absorbs mm. within the suit before it gets hit or something. That'd be quite cool. Oh, it's yeah, like yeah. the graphics of all the weapons going on his like hands and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, it looks really good. A shot of him with it with on his spine as well. It actually, goes, oh, it's yeah. going down his spine. Look crazy. It's back a, a back a bit here. Yeah, once you have. I don't know how disgusting that looks for a bit, I think. It's a bit where they all look shocked. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's, it's actually properly embedded yeah, in yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like on his spine. <clears throat> That's crazy. Could go a little, yeah, get a little bit of the body horror, as long as you don't end up mixing the horror with the comedy too much. Yeah. That's great. Yeah, they just go straight for his family as well. So, right, take his family. So, whoa, 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 <laughs> what? Like, calm down. You got this dude in a cyborg suit. Yeah, I, t I said Titanium Man. Isn't he a Iron Man villain? I'm just going mad. I'm just, I'm, I'm, it makes sense to be in an Iron Man villain, right? Titanium Man. Yeah. Yeah. That, uh, see, that to me looks like a an attempt to make a scarab suit. It's like the human black life. scarab. Yeah. But it's it's yes. like it's human, human made. Tech. Yeah. Because yeah. I wonder if that they that scene you saw it. with all of the what looked like the Reach stuff was just them trying to recreate the technology yeah. in Cord Industries. So the, the, the wires of going onto it doesn't isn't obviously in the same technology yeah, yeah. as the Scarab. Because so. the Reach doesn't really show up until the Scarab activates. Yeah. So that could be... Maybe that, obviously that looks different to the other one he was fighting because that was more of a square helmet without the T, right? Or unless it yeah, they did look different. Yeah, unless, it, that's, unless that's, that's, that's... the ultimate form, I'm guessing. Yeah, that's yeah, it. Yeah, it ends that's, up. That's, that's, the, yeah, that that's the start. Yeah, because it, yeah, you can see it's like... He's got bits of it. It looks like an exoskeleton yeah. thing. It doesn't have the full thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it could be right that they're trying to recreate their scarab mm. with their own tech. But then when he activates the scarab on his thing, yeah. the tech that they're using <coughs> activates, activates as well. and it makes him the full form, but he's not mm. a full proper scarab. You saw that scene of the, the pipes coming over him. Yeah, yeah. maybe yeah. that's the suit bond. He looked quite shocked when that was happening. Yeah, yeah like it doesn't usually happen that way because he doesn't have all the pipes here. No, yeah. that's just an exoskeleton. Well, yeah. So, like, it could be the suit that has some sort of scarab tech on it. And then when... The same black mesh suit underneath. The, uh... So he also gets it destroyed there. Cause yeah. It's like... Yeah, then when the... Where's the pipes here? When they... It, like, activates... Because that looks... Reach tech. Yeah, it's alienish, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So he looks and it go, looks like he's going into his skin. Yeah, it looks scared as well. He looks oh, scared yeah. He's actually plugging in as well. Proper body horror. <coughs> and then he ends up like that. That could be their take on the Black Scarab. So. Yeah. I mean, it could be that he has the exoskeleton thing. It doesn't work because it gets destroyed. Yeah. And then the Black Scarab arrives and activates because it wants to... Take, take him Because it's like, that's not... 
they want it back from the, the yeah. blue one back. I wonder right? if they're going to explain how like the scarab's offline and actually it's like it doesn't want to join the reach and stuff. I mean, like, you might see a flashback of Cord finding it, yeah, getting hold of it, mm. and then it disactivated for in some young, reason. In Young Justice, didn't it get like overloaded with electricity? And that's why it, it wiped its like core um, memories or something. It was Star Labs were doing a test on it, yeah, yeah. yeah. and he was just going past on his skateboard or his yeah, bike. Yeah, it blew up. And it, it blew up and it landed in front of him. Yeah, and then it saw him and then activated on him. Yeah, like it, it lost all his um, yeah originally it, it programming it got damaged when it came to earth when Dan Garrett the first movie found it but that's why it went sky psycho and made him become a villain mm-hmm. over time and then it landed in Egypt that's yeah. where he thought it was, he thought Egypt. It was Egyptian yeah. Yeah. yeah but it wasn't it was originally but they cleverly they cleverly into the story, it, which yeah, I really yeah. like about that yeah, yeah. They, uh, because they even use that in Young Justice where they yeah. go back and it's a Tara's doing a magical yeah. spell on it yeah, yeah it? she finds the yeah yeah yeah, yeah. And, yes that's how they try and get off of him although yeah. they, they Guess it's when he's turned evil, is it? In the end of season two, is that one? Like the, when when he's when he got because the black scarab like oh no, 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 so the green it. yeah green ape the green yeah the green one became friends and then <laughs> yeah, into yeah. it and then yeah. programmed it back yeah yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah yeah just looks he just looks great man yeah it looks so good so that, that could be the I'm glad that they're keeping him as well yeah yeah <laughs> yeah I mean, it'll mean more people going to watch this right because I get a feeling like why lots of people didn't bother going well, to watch it, the Flash I don't I, don't, I, don't, I doubt a lot of people are going to go and watch. Aquaman is because well that's the point it's, the new, it's not the not, and this one that actually is going to carry on so it's well, a lot of people watch. say like it's, the comparison is obviously Iron Man yeah you've got yeah. not a younger hero but it's the it's like Spider-Man and I'm a mixed yeah, yeah. with a bit of alien stuff in it as well so you can draw in the audience doesn't want to see it it's got a bit of a different vibe to everything that's come before it yeah and it's new and it's new yeah, it's yeah. Well, that's new for most for. people I mean yeah. obviously we're yeah, yeah. enough to have watched Young but it's Justice the first and, live action Blue Beetle theme yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah 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 I mean, I think, was he in Smallville? Did he not appear in Smallville? Yeah, he definitely appeared in something. I swear it's Smallville. Yeah. This, that's when Booster Gold was in it, right? I don't remember. Am I making sure. it up as a girl? Was it the Heimlich original tape? <coughs> I don't remember, I'm sure. I, I, remember. I remember a really bad live action suit. <laughs> and I swear it was Smallville, but it could have been something else. What other live action thing would it have been? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Hmm. I swear it was wrong. That's why Booster Gold turns up. Uh, Put it in Smallville Blue Beetle, see if it comes yeah. up with a picture. Because I, <laughs> I remember the things coming out the back, the little <laughs> yellow like scarab some thing. Some cosplay foam rubber Yeah, things, yeah, yeah look like cardboard walk, tubes yeah. and stuff. No, it wasn't that bad, but it was like, <laughs> you could tell it was sort of late 90s, early 2000s. Yeah, that's the thing. What was that from? It was Smallville. Yeah. Jimmy Reyes, yeah, yeah. Oh, I need to watch Norman again because yeah. I don't remember that at all. <laughs> that's. Anyway, yeah, that's Booster Gold. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I thought it was. Nice. I mean, I've only seen the episode once. But oh, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> so like I said, it yeah. was. It was I mean, at least it was, like, it was live action, at least. I did not no. remember that at all. That's obviously more of a practical suit. They've gone full CGI with this one. Yeah. Right? yeah. I remember Booster Gold being in it. I don't remember Blue Beetle. That's weird. Mm-hmm. Oh, well. Interesting. Yeah. You've got good memory, man. <laughs> yeah. no, so what would that have come out? That would have been like season six, probably. Season six or seven. Well, it Towards the end of the, the Justice League was doing, wasn't it? It was after that, I think. I can't remember. I can hardly remember who was in it. You remember what number? <laughs> <was it? laughs> I want episode number, man, and I want the time stamp. Yeah. God damn it. Yeah, no, it looks awesome. Can't wait to watch it in the cinema in IMAX. It's going to be beautiful. So everyone, that was the Blue Beetle trailer. Uh, what do you think about it? Come below, let us know. Are you excited for this character? Do you know who he is? Have you watched Young Justice like we have? And have you read the comics? What are you most excited about? Please come below, let us know. And if you're watching this right now, you're not subscribed. Please click that subscribe button. We're going to do lots of shows at the moment, so we'd love to you to join us on our merry journey through all the shows and movies that we're reacting to at the moment. So please click that subscribe button. We also have a Patreon set up where you can go and see all the full reactions of all the stuff we watch. And we also on social media links in the description below. And we also do a podcast. We're very busy people. Um, Go anywhere you uh, miss the podcast, type in this podcast, and you can find us there. And we'll see you very soon for another reaction.